In the Hong Kong sprint and Joe Marrero putting on an absolute clinic out here. Trainer John Size going one, two. Uh, you told me earlier today that to turn the tables on the field, you just needed to cross the wire first. But were you happy with how things were unfolding in front of you? Not when the gate opens that. I don't think he was fast enough. But he, we were not having him where we actually we want, what we want him to be. Uh, we thought we were going to be one pair closer back, but once we, I was turning for home and I could feel like I had paint in my hands, and um, I really realized that I was coming to win the race when we were too, one for long to go. So, yeah, a good surprise that will be at the back of my mind for the rest of my life. Hey, you have the rest of your life. Why is that? Why is this one so poignant for you? Because I've been, I've been associated with this horse for quite some time and uh, I kind of back on him. Uh, some people kind of uh, were doubting how good he was, probably putting him second behind some other horses in the race, but he, he went there to prove today that he's the best horse, the best sprinting in the moment. And, and uh, the best part of it is that I don't think that's it, I think that he's more to come from him. John, he's incredibly consistent, never been off the board in each of his stores. What, what is it about him that you make him so consistent? Oh, it's just his character. It's, it's just his will to win, his fighting spirit, all the good things that the horses have. Uh, he has all his attributes and uh, he helps himself a lot with his training. He saves his energy for race day. He'll sleep for a week now. He just used every ounce of energy he had in his body for, for the day's effort. And, uh, you know, it's humbling to see him always do that, actually. He must be a joy to train. Well, he's a joy when he, when he comes to the races, I can assure you of that. You're, you're going to go home with a check no matter what. Mm -hmm. So, uh, yeah, he's been an absolute pleasure. Well, what could be next for him? Well, we have uh, some Group 1 races in Hong Kong. The next one's uh, at the end of January, so that's his next mission. If he's uh, fit and well and he's in good shape, he wants to go again, or we'll, we'll go at the end of January. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Impressive performance today in the Hong Thank Kong you. Sprint.